that's where he played. That was a good shot, that by Latzelt. It's been uh, a successful week, hasn't it? And you've got an intriguing final, another one, third in a row. Paul, Lewis. Oh, wasn't close to it, was he? Surprised he didn't play the two cushion escape. Looked easier. Paul, trying to catch that red next to the black half ball. Selp did describe himself this week, and these are his words. He says, I'm a poor man's Mark Selby. If I'm not scoring well, my safety can carry me through. And already here, he's got Trump in a spot of bother. He's got to be careful here oh, about hitting it too hard. The yep. red next to the black is available. And very nearly hit it too hard there. Paul, oh, you missed. Let seven. It's four misses and 22 points, I make it. Paul, we missed him shot. That could be closer if he's hard Paul, enough. The miss. This time. Oh, wow. So close. The record is 16 consecutive misses, Stuart Bingham. <coughs> well, what's this now? The ninth attempt, I make it. He's trying something different. Oh. Well, he's getting good support from this yeah, crowd. He's looking at the two cushion escape now, and I think that would have been the ideal shot to start with. You know, okay, he might miss it the first time, second time. Paul, and a miss. Oh, has he left a free ball? Four. He had to give that some thought, three ball. and it could, be, it could be worse from there, playing it from there. 52 points he's given away here. So this is attempt number 11 to make contact with the red. Yep, it is. It. <laughs> no one was sure. No one was sure, were they? But because no foul was called, process of elimination, he's hit it. But it was costly in terms of points. He didn't leave a pot on, which of course was the whole idea. Well, he's, <laughs> he's failed to hit it from there now. But one bit of cheer, maybe. Stuart Bingham, that 16 misses the record. He won the frame eventually, but he's failed to hit it again, yeah. Trump. Yeah, you have to hit the red now. This is a total foul a thon. And now, yeah, yeah, two misses, so he has to hit it yeah. now, otherwise, he's lost the frame. Yep, if he doesn't hit it this time, frame over. Uh, there's still so many points on this could be a very high scoring frame now uh, he's hit that too hard so a good chance to play a good safety yeah it's incredible the, the amount of points that can be scored with all those those fouls and now a good safety from Joe Trump He's in a strange position, Sel, isn't he? He's got 76 points on the board. You think he can't lose the frame, but look at how many reds are still on. And if that goes in, which it has done, he's got the angle on the pink One. at the very least. Uh, he could stun into them. He doesn't need to because there's reds that he could play for. And now a great chance this to win the frame. We can get to the pink. Those four reds just above the black. I don't think any of them go, so he needs to leave an angle on the black. And he's got to think about it the next time. In fact, there's two, but he'd rather give them a little touch. If you're just tuning in, the, the point score is correct. 
Trump gave away 60 points in fouls earlier. Yeah. Yeah. Nicely on the green. And now he's favourite. Most points scored in a frame between two players, 192. Peter Lyons, I'm sure, is watching, and Dominic Dale may well be. They were involved in that. Peter won the frame, 108, 84. But if he were to take two blacks with the reds and clear up, he'd just pip it. Not that he cares about that, of course. He wants to win the frame. He had just travelled a little too far for comfort, but because he's a left-handed player, if he just goes past the pink. 58. Played for the green. What a frame this, <laughs> this has been. But as I say, the key thing was, despite all the trouble he was in, he didn't leave a pot on. 63. So after all of that, the brown <laughs> frame ball, Matt Selder scored 76 points, but 60 of them were found. Seven, so they certainly like that. What a great frame this is for Judd Trump. 78 in the front. 